Hey everyone, in today's video I'm going to answer a few questions of the small creator tag. So the first question is, how many years have you been on YouTube? Well, I created my channel back in 2007 and I just watched a few videos back in the days and I also uploaded a few stuff but I took those down, made them on private since it was me being an awkward teenager. But technically I think somewhere in 2015 maybe? So the second question is what was your very first video about? Well, I think I already answered it, me being a teenager, being weird. Yeah. Third question, who is your dream collab? That's a good question. I think maybe with Nincompoop from the UK and Onadi from the Netherlands and maybe also Pascal because he's just a crazy guy, random, and I just like his personality. And I also would like to collaborate with Roly or Roly Ungasha, who does a lot of body mod related content. He's just a very funny guy who just serials everything into anything. She's a regular live stream watcher and a regular Poop Troop member. Thank you. Kun je weer op verschillende manieren combineren? Netjes, stoer. Ik heb het met een hakje geprobeerd, maar ook met mijn creepers. Hij is, uh... Hij is heel groot. Hij is heel groot. Zo! Zo! Zal ik hier gewoon een foto van maken en op Tinder zetten? <laughs> Out to fix chicks. This is why you do not go and get your ears pierced at Claire's Accessories or a shopping mall or a shopping center or, you know, down the dentist or wherever these weird places now you're getting piercings with piercing guns because, oh my god, these people are not professionals. They do not know what they are doing. <laughs> Trot along, bitch. Question number four. What would it mean to you to make it on YouTube? Just make people laugh and because I really like to entertain people, I also like to educate people about anorexia and the healing process and yeah, the negative stuff that comes with it, the positive stuff that comes with it because it's more than people think. I mean, a reason why I'm on YouTube is just to entertain, to put a smile on people's faces with just being silly old me with my weird comments and also to inspire people despite what you're going through, like see, Look at me with my freaking shitty past. Like I had anorexia for 11 years, and now I'm on, I'm in full recovery. So I just wanted to prove that anything is possible. If you just persevere and be strong, you can basically do anything. Question number five: What is your end goal on YouTube? I don't really have an end goal. I just want to keep on inspiring people to get help, to get professional help from, yeah. I don't know, I just don't know. <laughs> I'm not really thinking these questions through, I think. I don't really have an end goal, I just want to entertain as long as Article 13 doesn't go through. Question number six. What is the hardest part about YouTube? I think just getting exposure, just getting viewers. I think that's it, because I'm quite a small creator. I don't do makeup related videos, I don't do things that are hot. I'm just being me, weird old me, I don't think things through, I don't do scripted shit. Question number seven, what is the best part about YouTube? I think the community and the people that are very like you, that you can get them to communicate with you and just create your own little friendship niche kind of thing and that you get to meet like-minded people like other YouTubers and yeah, just have this cool little community going on. Question number eight, what is the funniest comment you've ever gotten? I don't remember. I don't think I've really gotten funny comments. No, not really. Not yet. Guys, you should do more of your best. Question number nine. What is the meanest comment you've ever gotten? I think that would be my first collaboration with Kathy or Orfia here. Uh, someone made a nasty comment about my yellow teeth. Thank you. You are the first and last person to comment about my teeth. 
which I got done now. Question number 10. What other subject matter would you create a YouTube channel about? I don't know, I just like to put everything on my channel right here. It's about everything and nothing. It doesn't really have a certain theme. Question number 11. Why did you start your YouTube channel? Well, I think Kathy really got me into YouTubing back when I was going through quite a rough breakup. She said like, hey, just come on over, we'll do each other's makeup and we'll film it and it'll be a lot of fun. And ever since I've been making videos, well at least decent videos, not these weird random things. <laughs> I'm totally not doing weird things now either. <laughs> no, certainly not. What, <laughs> what videos are you embarrassed by? And that is question number 12. <sighs> I think my old videos when I was a teenager, that's why I, de I decided to take them down. And also, when I got these surprise boxes by an old friend of mine who isn't a friend of mine anymore, Long story, <laughs> but I don't know, I just didn't li didn't really like most of that was in those boxes. It was just basically a load of crap. She just wanted to get exposure, I guess, and I don't know. It didn't really work out for me, hence why I decided to take all those videos down with this person. Dean, what video are you the most proud of? Good question. Um, I don't know, a one... The one that I put a lot, 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 lot of work into is probably one of my fashion videos with Orfea, I think. Yeah, I'm quite proud of those videos. I am pretty proud of every collab I do with her because she's just an awesome person and we're friends. <laughs> Question number 14. What is your first YouTube memory? Well, we were in class of... IT I think and like I said back in 2007 and we just were like having like these uh, typography lessons dactyloid Dutch dactylography and like basically like learn to blind type which I can do because we had so many hours of that class you don't even want to know so many hours and I was done with my course and this person next to me as well and all of a sudden I see her like watching videos of this group called Nightwish, which I really liked at the time. I already knew them and I was like, yo, what is this freaking page? And she said like, hey, it's YouTube, it's like this video, this, um, yeah, video community kind of thing. And that's when I decided to upload all my crap, like, jackass-like stuff. And I'm talking about, yeah, 2007, I was like a young freaking teenager. I think I was 15? Yeah, I was 15 quite young <laughs> and then when my camel I was really into my camel romance as well and they would like always des decide to um, upload videos because the time difference and I was in class and I knew like at this time they're releasing a new video I need to check it out so when I was done with my course of course I ended up checking that video <laughs> I guess that was it thank you so much for watching my name is Cindy K. Hall don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit the little notification bell because YouTube sucks and doesn't always put my videos into your subscription boxes. Don't forget to creep it real with me and I will see you soon. Bye! Back, back, back from the dead.